A simple type of roulette is played with an ivory ball and a wheel set in motion. The wheel contains 38 compartments. 18 of the compartments are black, 18 are red, one is labeled zero, and one is labeled double zero. These last two are neither black nor red. A player places one dollar on either red or black. If the player picks the correct color of the compartment in which the ball finally lands, the payoff is two dollars. Otherwise, the payoff is zero. So we're going to find the expected value of the winnings. So first off, the player is placing a dollar bet and we're, the red and the black will be the same expected value because the red and the black both have 18 compartments. So this is not a combined probability with red and black together. It's they're either going to vote uh, place the bet for red or for black. So we're going to calculate it for either color. So I'm going to start by listing my outcomes, my wins and my losses. So if I win, that means the ball lands, let's just say on red. It's going to be the same expected value for black. So the value of winning is how much money you win after you deduct the cost to play the game. So it says we get a payoff of $2, but we have to pay a dollar. So the expected winning there would be just a dollar. Now the loss would be negative one dollar because that's the cost of the ticket. Now the probability of the outcomes X. The probability of winning is if the ball lands in a red slot and there are 18 reds out of 38 slots. So then the probability of losing is also going to have the same denominator of 38 we want to make sure that the numerators total up to 38. So if we just take 38, subtract 18, we get 20 remaining spots that are not red. So my next step is I'm going to multiply my outcomes by my probabilities and add those together. So I have 1 times 18 divided by 38 plus negative 1 times 20 divided by 38. I would type this in using your, uh, not your fraction key, but your division button so that your answer is in decimal form. So remember that this is dealing with cost and so it's dollars and cents. So um, 1 times 18 divided by 38 plus negative 1 times 20 divided by 38 is negative 0.05 if you round that to two decimal places. So it's about a loss of about five cents.